So FaceApp is this app that you can download either on your iPhone or Android that will take a picture of your face and then show you what you look like when you're young, when you're old, when you're wearing makeup with a different haircut, things like that. And it's gotten really popular lately specifically for the what do you look like when you're old feature. So we have a whole bunch of people who are putting their photos in to see, you know, ostensibly what they would look like when they get older. The app has actually been around for a couple of years, but somebody realized, oh, this app is developed in Russia, and people are a little bit uh, wary of Russia taking their data right now because of some of the scandals that we've had in the past and because of election concerns. That being said, yes, the app is developed in St. Petersburg, Russia, but the company claims that it's doing all of its processing on cloud servers hosted within the United States. So that means when you put in a photo and it sends it up to the cloud in order to like put all the AI on it and show you what you look like when you get old, that is happening in the US, so the company says. Yeah, the thing is that we see some of these pictures go into facial recognition databases, some of them get sold to third parties, some of them uh, are sold to data brokers. Now this app is saying, yes, we're using your data to target ads at you, but we're not selling your data. However, there's several exceptions to that in their privacy policy, such as if your data is anonymized or aggregated with a whole bunch of other people's, then yeah, they might share it. They do say that they delete most of the photos held in their server after 48 hours, but it's unclear what does most mean, and within those 48 hours, what exactly are they doing with it? I mean, everyone's surprised, but we shouldn't be because they've been doing this forever and games that, that have nothing to do with photos to have your photos. So I, I don't know. I, I it should change my habits. I should read the agreements and stuff, but I, I likely won't. If it provides value to me, which it made an old picture of myself, I guess that's me giving them everything that I have. I feel like these apps are kind of here to stay and people are getting addicted to them, they're going viral. Um, so it, I don't know if it'll limit my use, um, but it's definitely made me think a lot more about it. And until I have a little bit more proof, I probably would keep using the app.